the atrium of Akinash. A world shut inside another. This is what humans do when they don't understand a thing. They build walls around it. They put locks on the doors, and they put soldiers in front of those doors. The bigger the secret, the bigger the lock. And the craziest are those who want to pick it. May my ancestors forgive me. I'm one of those to my misfortune. Ah, this noise. These voices. I can't stand it. Amber. That damn golden mud oozing from the heart of the world tree. A magma of sticky dreams. All the thoughts of those who wanted to taste the forbidden sap. Humans. Elves. All their private little chatter is mixed up in this disgusting soup. A flood of ideas constantly flowing into my head for all these years. It took so long for me to find this place. With each step, I heard my voice a little less and all the others a little more. I'm so tired. It's time to finish it. While I can still recognize my own thoughts. The heart of the tree. It's why I'm here. That, at least, I'm sure is my own desire. Take possession of this source of infinite power, but also misfortune. It's time to move to the first phase of the plan. Drop your weapon. And it starts now. Beast, wake up. Answer when Lord Barnum speaks to you. Who are you? Speak. My name is Styx. There's a surprise. The elves give names to their monsters. Where do you come from? I've never seen anything that looks like you. I am one of a kind. It's the elves who created it, Father, that's obvious. They pulled this runt out of their sticky larvae, and they sent it here to spy on us. Speak! Is it the elves who sent you? Why are you here? <laughs> elves... If you only knew. They don't need spies to find out what's going on in this accursed tower. So, you're working for them. What did you come here for? I came for the heart of the tree, of course. I knew it. Those degenerates want to retake the tree and keep their precious amber for themselves. Father, we must bring them to heal while we still have time. Enough, Aaron. I secured this alliance with the elves and I intend to respect it. For the moment, we need the elves. You know it very well. Rubbish. Oh yes, you do need the elves. How many of you poor little humans died the last time you tried to extract amber by yourselves, huh? How many? Hundreds? Oh yes, you do need the elves. But they don't need you. How long do you think you can lock them up in their own world? The amber is theirs. The tree is theirs. The heart of the tree is theirs. And I intend to get my hands on it and take it away from here. They're dying to get their tree back, eh? But they won't do a thing. We have an agreement. An agreement? We don't sign agreements with people who have amber in their veins. <laughs> You're out of your depth, Mr. Governor. Oh, ho, 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 you've got some nerve. <laughs> I'm sure you've never even seen the heart of the tree. Oh, but I have seen it. Since I've been holed up in the bowels of the atrium, I can see it night and day, even in my dreams. And every day I say to myself, Hey, Rakash, the heart of the tree is over there, almost within reach. And by your life, you're gonna find some way to steal it, because you're not leaving the tower without it. Hello and welcome oh, to Sticks. Yeah. Oh, this headache. What? I, where was I? Shit, my brain is an anvil. Yeah, yeah. The heart of the tree. 
What did I do with my dagger? I feel naked without my dagger. I gotta find it quick. I should be able to climb up there. Yes, you are. So, this here is sticks. He's a goblin. Uh, he's a very nasty goblin. He is a junky goblin. And he's a thief. From. It's not from here. Yeah, well, don't get excited. We'll play for it with dice tonight. In the meantime, keep your hands off. Okay, okay. I'll wait till tonight. They must be talking about my dagger. It can't be far away. So, this is one of the first games I've ever finished. And I honestly think it's a really un underappreciated game. Because you know, I should drink this flask. It would perk me up a little. You know, with teeth series. <laughs> uh, well, I'm climbing, I guess. Yep. With the Thief series being really the... Ooh, stay out of good job. By my dagger. Yes, with the Thief series being the first and the best stealth games, it's really tough to create something that will match it. Anyway, those guys tried, and I think they did a good job. Always keep to the shadows and walk where it doesn't make too much noise. Avoid running and farting. Mostly farting. Um, well, this game does not focus on stealing as much as Steve does. It does require you to keep stealthy. The world tree. It seems so close. But it's a mirage. It's so big that it seems to be close. But I still got a long way to go. So, from what I heard, the only access to the heart is a bridge which that two-faced Governor Barron has had closed off with a tamper-proof lock. And he keeps the only key in his apartments. And as if that wasn't bad enough, the whole area is crawling with elves. I'm gonna have to go down into the prisons and free my... Uh, friend. He knows how to deal with an elf. <laughs> so, if I'm gonna survive in this tower, I'm gonna need somewhere safe to get organized, as well as a map of the atrium. Well, I'll get nothing done standing around here. I'll get my dagger, and it's off to work. So, as of today, we have two games focusing on sticks, and... Uh, gotta be sneaky here. If I stay under there, I won't be seen. And there's also one more game in which sticks is featured, but it is, well, is half of a main character. And don't get me wrong, uh, I've played this game, but I am not willing to go for 100% uh, in any case. There you can do 100% by uh, going stealth, uh, not killing anyone for each mission. Uh, you can collect coins. Ah, there's my dagger. I was afraid that I lost you, my beauty. You can collect coins. Mm -hmm. There are maps of the zone stuck up here. They might be useful for finding a way to the tree. Let's see. We got maps of the area. I'll need more than that to get what I want. Mm, so, not getting found out. And I haven't even taken right. any amber. <laughs> and be careful with <laughs> uh, when walking around. Nothing to reports. OK. 
okay no one here um so we are not going for 100 in anything i will be seen i will have to kill some of the guards i won't pick up all of the coins i won't rush to the exit of the level i won't hunt for all the uh, secrets some i will get not all of them um because if you want assassins rule oh. number one yep. always strike from behind especially when the fucker is twice your size and remember to land on the carpet to make less noise yes and one more thing yeah. Yeah, basically if you want a real 100% in this game you have to replay it multiple times Yeah, but you can leave the pool of blood. <sighs> they... No, they won't check the furniture for bodies, so once you hide them, they should be out of sight. Uh, yeah, no, we will avoid fighting as much as we can, because we are fragile, we are little goblin. But I have to do this, because the game wants to teach me. I hate it. <laughs> no, of course you have... You get the tutorial for everything. Ah, oh, right. It's... This... Well, I think the game went, uh, was published when tutorials for everything were a must. That's what we get here. They show you how to fight. You should not fight. You should avoid fighting at all costs. Uh, no, as I can see. All right, let's keep going. Can you see? I wasn't hurt that bad in this encounter, but the further we go, sand, a little spit, that could put that torch out from here. The further we go, the more vulnerable we are. Um, change item, throw a ball of sand. Yeah, he's gonna be watching. It's actually funny because I've played this game a couple of years back. Come on. They can look under the tables, so you need to be careful about that. There usually are multiple ways we can go about. Like I said, I will be seen. And I also managed to... Yeah, you should not be able to stand up here. Show, shoo, shoo. So there's the stealth. Mission failed. Away. No, 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 no. Sometimes you are able to hang from the uh, edges, but not always. <laughs> yeah, we need to. Uh, 
backtrack a little bit. I should, I will be doing quick saves a lot later on. All right. Um, let's keep going. Yes, let's keep going. Hopefully, it won't happen again. This in Sam, such a stupid way. A could put that torch out from here. There should be... What I'm looking is... Oh, this. So we can stick to a wall. And be less visible. Come on. Come on. Yes, we don't have to... Okay, uh, we don't have to go through the balcony, we can go under the table and there are mushrooms. And mushrooms indicate a small... ...walk we can use. Small corridor. But now they are all... ...ish. Nice and easy. Okay, but that brings us here. Also, you can see that up there is also a way. You can probably walk on one of those beams. Hey. This is what I tried to do before we got brutally killed by falling. And this is the place where I will use Safe point because I honestly I'm not sure. Sounds like guys. I don't remember being able to go through this place without being noticed. That's the problem, I think. They should be walking around and instead...
They are just standing. You think I haven't seen you? Yes. And we also get experience points. We there is a level up leveling system. Okay, but that's done. Oh my I gotta get me some amber. Yeah. That that would straighten me out. Down there maybe? Also, one more thing, my controller is screwed up a little bit, so I'll get some endpoints out uh, without me doing them. To study these cocoons more closely, it would be fascinating. Ah, quite so, my dear colleague. I'd be willing to give my complete edition of the Encyclopedia of Mycology for the right to dissect one. You're telling me? Hey. One doesn't dissect the embryos of one's political allies, I suppose. Perhaps. A quick peek through the keyhole just to make sure the way is clear? Yes. Let me see, there's no one. And if you think that unlocking the door, Amber, I gotta get some now. Uh, if you think My that unlocking the door takes too much time, hey, come on, we are doing this under pressure. the coin I was talking about with Mist Free already, I believe. Yes. Uh, uh, create the clone. Well, I got no choice. I'll need some help. Uh, control clone. Cash. I need your run carcass. Ugh. Damn it, I hate to. Through the gate, pull the lever. Yeah, <laughs> you want something done right? Steal a body and do it yourself. <laughs> So what we can do here is, you see the chandelier here? You need to be careful, right? Um, now, the thing is, I don't remember if you can jump on the thing itself. Okay, yes, you can. camera is working with you when you are hanging on those points. What I mean is that it will help you. Oh, this is what I meant. Oh. Okay, I screwed it up. I could have led him to that other room. Oh, heck. Thank you.
have to use the amber vision to find my way. Yes, amber vision, but first let me find somewhere to hide. There's a lot of stuff here we can find. Um, amber vision. With all this finding work, I never find the time. This is amber vision. Toward the hideout, we can go over there. And what you saw there lit up was the place we can hide. more places on the wall I can use to climb down but I don't see any but if I can use this to muffle oh shit indeed come on come on come on Gone. You see what's there? Alarmed? Oh! Almost. Oh, all are, are alarmed. So we need to be careful. Shit, on it. So we need to be careful and you... I think you cannot save. Uh, guys? Okay, thank you. I may miss some side missions. Because like I said, I'm focusing more on survival. Oh. We need to get up there. No proof. I need the two of them to be out of my way. We're gonna climb this. Because I know I don't see any way up here. That screwed up controller. But we are done. Shit! A sliding grill. I'm stuck. Ah, this is impossible. There's got to be a way. There's so easily. And this one I don't see. Honestly, those I don't see. He should rise the gamma a little bit. Hey, sticks! Over here! What's that? Somebody there? It's Ozcan. I'll open the passage for you. Hurry up inside! Huh? Ozcan? Oh, my head! Yeah. I know that name. Ozcan. 
Yes, you can trust him. Anyway, you don't have a choice. About time, Sticks. I've been waiting for ages. I was beginning to wonder if Barryman and his gang hadn't done you in. There was a slight hitch. Well, I think so. Ah, my head feels like a wagon's gone through it. Well, we'll take care of that later. What are you doing here? Well, I'm here to tell you that I found a hideout, like you asked me to. I asked you? Uh, yeah, of course I asked you. Damn this headache. It must be why I can't remember what I did even yesterday. Good. I'm off to the hideout then. You'll tell me the way? All you have to do is follow the marks I made here and there. You'll see. This is my personal system. As soon as you see the mark, then you know that one of my hiding places is near. You can go inside. There's one close by with, as it happens, a list of other hiding places. You'll see. I often put some useful stuff inside. Thanks. I'm off. Whoa, 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 wait. You'll have to pick up the sewer pry bar in another hiding place. Oh, yeah. Uh, one thing I didn't tell you. The hideout is in the, uh, sewers. But you know how it is. The more it smells like shit, the quieter it is. You'll fit right in. And to think I was beginning to like you. Sorry to disappoint you, but with your looks, it's best not to take risks. And anyway, the royal suite was already taken. In short, go on ahead, pick up the pry bar, and open the entrance to the sewers. I'll see you at the hideout. Oh, well. Looks like Ozcan carries a flask in his belt. Let's hope I haven't lost my touch. <laughs> Like I said, we are active. Um, so I am actually gonna end this part here. So for now, thank you very much. I could easily find Stay alive and see you soon. Not this. So, bye.